Hi, this is Craig with Mobile Monkey, and I'm very excited to share with you today our email widget, which is a pro feature of Mobile Monkey. And I'm going to give you an overview of it. We're going to set it up right inside the dashboard, and then we're going to do an actual live example so you can see how it works. All right, let's get going. All right, we're here at our dashboard, and now we're going to be looking at the email pro widget. Now to get access to that, you click on Dialogs, and then up here at the top, if you hit More, you're gonna see down here on the second row an Email Pro Widget. Now I'm gonna show you how we use that. So we're gonna to go to Schedule an Appointment, and I'm gonna show you. If you all were to click on this, it would add the widget at the bottom, and then you could just fill it out. Now I've already filled it out so we're just going to go over it here. So we have the email that it's going to go to. We have the subject. So in this case it's a salon appointment request. And then I'm going to put, hi you have an appointment request. First name is requesting a service appointment on day at time. Please contact them at phone or email them at email to confirm. So what these things right here, these are called attributes. And if you click on this little icon right here, you're going to see all of the attributes in your bot. So if we go up here to this form we've created, another pro feature which we're going to be discussing in another video, you can see that we have attributes right here. So this is the service attribute, and we've got facial nails or permanent makeup. Then we've got the day attribute, and this is where they're going to choose what day. Then we have the time attribute. This is where we ask them what is a good time. And then we ask them for their email and their phone number. So once that's all filled out, Mobile Monkey will take all that information based on the attributes that we've asked and it will email them to wherever we want. We can put a comma in here and put multiple emails if you've got multiple managers that this needs to go to. So what we're going to do now is we're going to do a test so you can see this thing in action. Alright, so to test this we're going to click this button right here. We're going to test the dialog and we're going to go to the page and as you can see right here it says what service are you needing I'm gonna say a facial and then what day I'm gonna say Tuesday and I'm gonna say 3 p.m. is when I'm available and then I'm gonna verify my email and then my phone number and then thanks we'll be in contact with you to confirm now, if I go to my email, you will see the message that gets sent. So let's go to my email. All right, we're in my email. You can see here, this was just sent. Salon appointment request. Hi, you have an appointment request. Craig, which was an attribute, is requesting a facial, which was another attribute. Appointment on Tuesday at 3 p.m., which those are also attributes. Please contact them at phone number, which was an attribute, or email them at email to confirm. So that's super powerful because you're able to get leads right from the bot. Now let's go back to the bot, and I'm going to show you another way I like to use the email widget, and that is in the default dialog. So in Mobile Monkey, you have these different dialogues. So sometimes you're going to have a subscriber go into your bot and not really hit the button or do what the bot is asking them to do. And what's going to happen is it's going to get confused. So we've sent them a default message. And what that message says is, sorry, I'm just a bot, but someone will be right with you. Now, there's no real way to know about this unless you go into the Facebook page into the inbox and check and see if any messages got stuck. So what I like to do is add a email widget here and just let them know that the bot is stuck. So anytime this message pops up, it's going to go here, it's going to send an email, it's going to say the bot is stuck, please check the bot. So now I know that I can go to messages, 
go to my Facebook page, go to inbox, and I can see where the bot is stuck and I can be able to help whoever, you know, whatever question, usually they ask a question and I can just respond to that question and then everything's good to go. So that is the email pro widget. If you have any questions on it, you can post a message to the group or you can send an email to support at mobilemonkey.com. Thanks.